leads to the catastrophe. In the world's worst mid-air collision, the sequence started eight minutes before impact, at 6.33 p.m., when Saudi 763 takes off. VK Data assigns them 10,000 feet. Kazakh 1907 is at about 23,000 feet. Both aircraft are in the same airspace on opposite headings. This should not have happened. This is the first mistake, the first link in the chain of events that leads to the disaster. To avoid this, the airspace above Delhi airport should have been unidirectional. There should be two separate air corridors, one for the departing aircraft and the other for arriving aircraft. Then two aircraft on opposite headings would never share the same airspace. But this wasn't the case at Delhi airport. There just wasn't enough room. Part of the airspace is reserved for the Indian Air Force. Why do we have always have to wait for any kind of disaster, a catastrophical disaster? Can't we do it before so many innocent lives are lost? There may be certain constraints which I can understand, but not to, a, not to an extent where we have to wait for a crash or it is something like a time bomb ticking. The time bomb is ticking. Six minutes to impact. Kazakh 1907 contacts VK Data for the first time. He assigns them 15,000 feet. Descent to flight level 150, report reaching. Descent in 150. The radio operator acknowledges the height, but astonishingly does not inform the two pilots. Worse still, the navigator also hears the assigned flight level on his headset. He is heard converting it to meters for the two pilots, but neither of them acknowledges the assigned height. This is the second mistake, the second link to disaster. My personal view is, is, is that there was confusion with the pilots about what their cleared altitude was. Um, there may have been some language difficulties. The pilot and co-pilot's knowledge of English is limited. The radio operator is translating all commands from the Delhi air traffic control for them. Pilot flies, gets the information directly makes a lot of difference. The reactions are spontaneous, instantaneous. Two minutes to impact. Kazakh 1907 is gradually descending. It's now at about 16,000 feet. Captain Cherepenov the pilot who is not flying is supposed to inform the cockpit crew of the estimated time and height to level out. He never does. This is the third link to the disaster. He was the captain of the aircraft, he's the commander of the ship, so he should have known.